Hey, this is Shabbats. We're back in Factory Town Tycoon. Now, in this video, we... I just harvested 10... There's 11 logs here. There should be. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 11. So that's another oak tree of logs. And there's the nails I bought in the last video. Here is the sawhorse that you make in the tutorial. And I built a saw which I'll show more about building in another video. So what I wanna show now, we, we sold those logs and made $110. And if we, and I have a cart. So I'm gonna assume we have a, a little cart, at least the basic, and take our ax and make a pillar. I'm just gonna take it and drop it here by tapping on it. I'm gonna do another one. So what's happening here is simple. We're doubling our money because a log we know sold for $10 and a pillar sells for $20. So now if we take this back to our base and simply process these on the sawhorse, throw them in our wagon. So instead of the, you know, the logs, now we're, we have, we're up to $60 now instead of 30. And if we take the log, and now we know if we double process it and make a few planks. Now let's see if I can remember the planks. One is $7 in town, because I remember it's $21 for three. And I think up above it is seven, eight, nine dollars. Nine times three is 27. Oops. So we got $10 for a log, I think 19, or is it 20 for a pillar, and 27 for turning it into planks. So that's just with the basic sawers, we can do that. Now if you saved up a little bit of money and you were able to um, buy the blueprint for the saw, then it's gonna save you a lot of trouble. So let's take the rest of these logs and assume So the blueprint I think was maybe let's say it's a couple of hundred bucks. Oops, and you have to build it after you buy the blueprint. Okay, I'm gonna do that not again. This time I'm press the right button. And then we would take some of those nails that we bought. And then we would take some of those pillars that we made. Whoops. I can do this. I'm a little difficulties driving this morning. My cart. So if we took the trouble to buy the blueprint and made a saw out of those nails that we bought. So that took four of our logs. I know we could have sold that for money, but so now we have a saw. So now we take our logs and we just drop them right on there. So there's no more hatchet. And if you place them one, so, you know, depending if you want to make a mixed bag, Oops. So I'm, in, I'm making a, big, a mixed bag right now. There's a, I made a pillar and a couple more planks. So I've got, I think you can hold, I think we decided you could hold 10 items, right? Safely hold up to 10. And I didn't mention this with the, oh yeah, because I haven't really done much about the wagon yet. But let's say our wagon is full. Don't forget, you can always carry one on your shoulder. Whether it's a box of nails, a log, whatever. That's one more item to sell. So, we're going to go sell. So, of course, I have the fancy cart, but which is the regular flatbed that you use the pedals to drive, which is pretty funny. So, don't forget to look at that. If you just go buy a cart and a horse the first time, you don't get to ever see the little pedals on the cart. 
so right now we've, you know, this hall, instead of sitting here and, and making logs, which is great to start with, we've taken it to the next level. Now we have planks and pillars. So I'm going to park my cart here because I'm going to go up top. So I could sell these for seven and for 16. I just wanted a refresher. And it might be full up there, so we're taking a chance, but that's what you want to do if you want to make some extra money. Oh, look at that. Almost looks like a little secret cave. And I found out with my cart, the game will steer for me. Like if I drive right into this almost every time, watch it won't work. Oh, there it goes. And it'll still steer me towards the oars. I need all the help I can get in driving, believe me. So here we go past the pine forest and the iron oars. Let's see, am I going to miss this tree or am I going to run right into it? You ever notice in driving games... There'll be like this big giant wide track and you're and then a turn comes up and as you make the turn there'll be like one tree and for some reason when I'm in driving it my car just makes a beeline for the one tree no matter what I do. Anyway, I just had to do a little filler there. <laughs> okay, we're here. We're here. All right. So now these planks I forgot how much, look how much money, oh, I got 5400 bucks. So what I would do now is basically what I do with the logs. I'm going to tap and get all my stock out of here. Okay, that's a pillar, so I'm going to make its own little pot hill here first. Pillar, pillar, okay, that's some planks. So I'm going to stand over here and start selling my planks. And I already know if I do the math, what's this? What did I say it was? Nine bucks. So nine times three, so I'm getting 27 for every three, which is one log. And 27 is 54. Don't need that yet. A couple more planks, so yeah. This can really help open up a lot of blueprints. Just one trip up here. A couple more nails, a box, a box of nails. So what was that, four pillars or five? That was 80 or $100 extra. So yeah, it's definitely worth a trip. So basically that's it. We went from making, harvesting logs and selling them to doing a little bit of processing and making a lot of extra money. Doubling at least, if not more. Not quite tripling. All right, I think that's it for this video. Quick way to make some extra money off those logs you made. Let's go out to the title screen. There it is. Factory Town Tycoon, how many? 500. Thanks for watching.